In this presentation, we're going to look at Laplace transforms. So, determine the Laplace transform of the following expression. Function of t, f of t equals cos 3t minus sine 3t. Here's a table of Laplace transforms we're going to use, or more to the point, an extract from it. We, I've edited it down so we have the entries that we're going to use for this example, but in a proper Laplace transform table, there would be much more. So let's look at the entry for cos 3t. The appropriate entry in the tables is cos of a t. So we're going to let a equal to 3. So the Laplace transform of cos 3t equals s over s squared plus 9, which is 3 squared. Similarly, we're going to do the same thing for sine of 3t. And again, a is 3. So the Laplace transform of sine 3t equals 3 over s squared plus 9. So let's put this all together. So the function of s, the function of t that we'll have is cos 3t minus sine 3t. So the uh, corresponding Laplace transform of this function, f of s, is s over s squared plus 9 minus 3 over s squared plus 9. We would write that as s minus 3 over s squared plus 9. Now, just an important point to make. I'm going to make this, change my pen to green. We have a quadratic term here in the denominator. So this is quadratic. And when we have quadratic terms in the denominator, we look to factorize them. So in this particular case, no, not this time. The reason is we will get um, s squared equals minus 9. So we're getting into complex values there. So not this time. But in general, it's something to look out for. So to sum up, the, the answer is f of s equals s minus 3 over s squared plus 9. That's the correct answer to this problem. And that ends the presentation.